今天下午要与大家分享的题目是人生三部曲。So this topic I would like to share with you this afternoon is the trilogy of life. 呃，人这个字很容易写，只有两画。So it is very easy to write the Chinese character for man because it's only two strokes. 可是要认识他，却是一生一世。啊、uh, ，有可能也不能完全认识。But、it's difficult to get to know a person even for the entire his entire life.、Uh, not just a person about man. About, about man in general is difficult to understand. 呃、uh, ，那人生呢，更不能很容易的去理解他。And it's even more difficult to understand life. 呃、uh, ，因为它不像呃。Uh, Because it is not something that is a scientific or a mathematical concept. Like one plus one gets us two. Ah, red plus red equals green. The mixture of red and blue colors gives us purple. The mixture of red and blue colors gives us purple. Life is more like a machine that uses its brain to make a mold. It 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 uses its brain to make a mold. 色啊，色料，然后放进火窑中。So life is more like the practice of pottery, where earth is molded and then placed in a kiln. 啊、uh, ，那它放进火窑的时候，它不知道出来的产品是怎么样的。And when this Thing object is placed into the kiln or the oven. One is not entirely sure what the outcome will be like. Ah, because theoretically, my mold's color is black. Actually, I'm supposed to be green or red. So although what I may paint is green, but it may turn out to be blue. No, I, I, no, 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 no. The, the glaze works this way. It looks green, but what I would expect is blue or red. Uh, it's like that. That's glaze. So, but this is not a sure. But again, this is not a sure. For sure. I want that color to be green. So, although the color that I want is red. Ah, but when it comes out, it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. Ah, but it may turn out to be blue or red. So although I may mold the earth into or the clay into a particular shape,、嗯呃、水分也足够 ，and the water is sufficient. 可是偏偏出来哈，却却有裂痕。But it may turn out to have cracks.、嗯嗯、那有时候呢，有一些呃陶器呢，你是故意放一些东西给它。列得很漂亮，很均匀。And although some potters may add a material to try to make it more beautiful and perfect. 呃，裂有裂痕哈 ，is is a cracker days, so that you you have some cracks, uh, very symmetrical and balanced cracks on the pottery. 可是，一出来呢，连一个裂痕也没有，或者一个大裂痕，其他地方不裂，那就很难看了。So although the potter may intend to place Cracks deliberately, but it may turn out to either have no cracks at all or cracks that are not expected. Hmm. Life, perhaps, is also like a butcher. Ah, butcher, 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 ah, So when a baker bakes, ah, he puts it into the that 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 pan, ah, ah, the dough that he places into the oven. Ah, it it when it comes out, maybe it doesn't burst, maybe it's too hot. Maybe it may not rise or maybe become or maybe very hard. Ah, so it's very difficult to predict. So it's very difficult to predict. Ah, of course, life is even more unpredictable. We look at, ah, the natural world. Ah, of course, life is even more unpredictable. We look at, ah, the natural world. Ah, of course, life is even more unpredictable. Look at nature. It has an order. It has its regulations. So, we humans are very fickle. 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 So, So we know how to operate within this nature. Ah,、uh, 比如说，呃，地心吸力 
For example, the law of gravity. It's consistent. It's also predictable. There will not be a situation where tomorrow the force of gravity is so strong you cannot lift your leg. Nor will there be a situation where the force of gravity is so weak that you are floating. So, 飞机起飞跟降落都非常的顺畅。So planes can fly and take off very smoothly. 我们也可以很精准的瞄准那个地方。要我们也知道说几个小时能够抵达。We can also very precisely note how long it takes for a plane to reach the destination. 可是有时候还会是有空难啊。But there still happened at a disaster. It's not totally according to human error. Because even the best pilots do not cannot fully predict. So although there is order in the universe and in nature, we still have no complete understanding of it. So that's why it's not completely predictable. Because we do not have full understanding. What about spiritual understanding? It is also limited. Because we want to spend our entire lifetimes trying to understand human life. We might use our entire lives to seek for answers to life. But we may not get complete answers. So it almost seems that our whole life is in vain. But those of us who believe in the Lord, we are truly blessed. Because through the scriptures, God explains to us what life is about. If we know God, we will know ourselves. And there are books in the Bible known as the books of wisdom. And through the trilogy of life, we will study three books of the Bible. The first is the book of Proverbs. And the Proverbs is written by the wise man in the Bible. Uh, you know, compiled. It's compiled by the wise uh, man in the Bible. Solomon, he wrote a lot. And many of these were compiled by Solomon. That, uh, the second book is the book of Ecclesiastes. That, the third book is the book of Job. That, the third is the book of Job. That, the third book is the book of Job. That, the third book is the book of Job. That, the third book is the book of Job. And these three books are very different narratives and description of man's life. Because they use different perspectives to view life. Let's first discuss the book of Proverbs. This book is very well-known. So the Proverbs can be likened to a young man who is brought up very well. Because it tells us and that the Lord of the heavens and the earth is the true God in heaven. He governs everything. He uses his, he has used his wisdom to create the universe. And if we act according to his wisdom, and we see the wisdom in creation. And we walk according to this wisdom. Then all will be well. And if we do not walk according to the wisdom that we see, but instead we walk against the will, heaven, of, heaven. The will of heaven, and then we will suffer. So it's very direct. It's 
啊、uh, ，clear， it's very clear。啊，这就是真言书。And this is the book of Proverbs。那呃，传道书呢 ？What about the book of Ecclesiastes？ 传道书就好比一个老年人。The book of Ecclesiastes is like an old man。他看腻，看透也看腻啊，这世界所有的罪恶，所有的不公平。He's seen through and seen all of the unrighteousness and injustice in the world。不公平就是。好人不一定有好的结局。Injustice is where a good person may not enjoy a good reward. 传道是恶人活得非常亨通。Instead, the wicked prosper. 好人早死，恶人长寿。And the good man has a short life, while the wicked man enjoys longevity. 人生啊、呃，有很多难料的事情。人生很。很很多不测的事情。There are many things that are difficult to understand or to know this life. 那最后呢？无论你是进钱或不进钱，好，我们就像呃没有灵性的畜生一样的死亡了。And finally, whether you're godly or ungodly, you will also perish like animals who have no souls. 嗯，这就是传道书。And this is the book of Ecclesiastes. 所以他所描述的人生。啊、uh, ，跟智慧的那个真言是不一样的。So the narrative of life in the book of Ecclesiastes differs from that in the book of Proverbs. 那叶伯记呢 ？What about the book of Job? 叶伯记，我们读的时候有时候会觉得更荒谬了。So we might be even more puzzled when they read the book of Job. 有一个哈， uh, 有一个呃，敬、uh, 虔的人。There is a God-fearing man. 啊、uh, ，当他在人生辉煌的年岁。When in, he is in his prime,、哦、可能就是四十四十多岁这样子啦。Perhaps in his forties,、啊、he's middle-aged. 哦,哦，事业非常成功。He's fairly successful、嗯、in his career. 啊、呃，在座可能很多都是属于这个年龄阶阶段。Many, probably among us seated here,、嗯、are like this person. 所以这个人约伯，他是一个敬虔的人，连神也说他是敬虔的人。So Job is an upright, God-fearing man. Even God describes him as such.、嗯、那当他啊，人生最辉煌的时候啊，他突然间失去了一切。In his prime, suddenly he loses everything. 不是他逆天而行。不是他逆天而行 ，not that he has gone against. It is not because he has gone against the will of heaven. 他是他是敬虔的人、啊。Because he is a godly man. 呃，所以呢，不是因为他做错而失去了一切。So it is no fault of his that he has lost everything. 因为他受了不该受的苦难。And because he has to suffer undeservedly. 呃，那他的遭遇呢，就跟真言书所提倡的完全相反，完全的有抵触。And so his Outcome is completely different, and in contrast to that shown in the book of Proverbs. So, we need to understand these three separate books of wisdom. So, how are we these three separate books of wisdom? These are all the words of the scriptures. They are all the words of the scriptures. How can we reconcile? How can we understand this trilogy? How can we reconcile? How can we understand this trilogy? How can we reconcile? How can we understand this trilogy? How can we reconcile? How can we understand this trilogy? How can we reconcile? How can we understand this trilogy? How can we reconcile? How can we understand this trilogy? How can we reconcile? 真言啊 ！Let's first focus on the proverbs. 真言呢，它是告诉我们一些绝对啊，而且是神圣的原则。Proverbs gives us absolute and divine principles. 啊，神的原则是绝对的。Because God's principles are absolute. 因为善恶本来就是绝对的。Because good and evil are absolute. 好，我们来看真言第三章。Proverbs chapter three, 第十八到十呃十三到十八节 verses thirteen to eighteen. This week, happy is the man who finds wisdom and the man who gains understanding, for her proceeds are better than the profits of silver and her gain than fine gold. She is more precious than rubies, and all the things you may desire cannot compare with her. Length of days is in her right hand; in her left hand, riches and honor. Her ways are ways of pleasantness, and all her paths are peace. Eighteen. She is a tree of life to those who take hold of her, and happy are all who retain her. Very simple, very easy to understand. Ah, we may not have this perfect understanding. 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 So the young people who have come later will say this is correct because this is what my parents have taught me. Ah, 宗教界的老师也是这么教我的，要当好
啊、呃，要当好学生，要当好孩，当好孩子。So the RE teachers also teach me the same thing.、Mm. Uh, teach me the same thing to be a good student and good children. 善有善报，恶有恶报。And that the good are rewarded and the bad punished. 无论你在哪里做什么。Regardless of what you do, wherever you are, 主耶稣都在看你哦。The Lord Jesus is looking at you. 可是长大之后 ，But when we have grown up, 啊，我们呃的一些经历可能会让我们怀疑。True, some of our experiences may lead us to doubt. 嗯，那我们再来看第八章。Let's look at chapter eight. 第八章二十二到二十六节。Verses twenty-two to twenty-six. The Lord possessed me at the beginning of His way, before His works of old. I have been established from everlasting, from the beginning, before there was ever an earth. When there were no depths, was brought forth. I was brought forth. When there were no fountains abounding with water, before the mountains were settled, before the hills, I was brought forth. While as yet He had not made the earth or the fields or the primal dust of the world, when He prepared the heavens, I was there. When He drew a circle on the face of the deep, twenty-eight. When He established the clouds above. When he strengthened the fountains of the deep, this is the wisdom of personification. This is the personification of a wise wisdom. wisdom. Um, so wisdom is like a person, and he speaks. So wisdom is like a person, and he speaks. So from twenty-two to twenty-six, we know that God uses wisdom to create this world. So from verses twenty-two to twenty-six, we know that God uses wisdom to create the world. Um, ah. 这呢不单指啊、呃、那个呃有智能的设计哈，我们看天地万物啊都有一个好像有一个智慧者很有设计的。So it does not only refer to intelligent design of the universe. 它、呃、更是指着神呢以他的智慧的大原则啊来掌管这个宇宙。In particular, it refers to how the Lord controls this universe through His wisdom. 呃，所以我们有十四章这么说啦。And in chapter fourteen, it says. That Proverbs chapter fourteen, verses one and two. The wise woman builds her house, but the foolish pulls it down. Two. 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 Uh, 智慧的原则呢，来掌管这个世界。God uses His principles of wisdom to govern the world. 所以我们要去理解神的智慧。So we must understand the wisdom of God. 也要以智慧来治理我们自己的家庭。We must also use wisdom to govern、嗯、our house. 所以我们顺着这种的智慧。And if we walk according to this wisdom, 就能够建立我们自己的家室。We shall be able to establish our households. 啊，也啊，比较呃，如果我们把这扩大 ，And if we extrapolate this, 那我们整个人生呢，也充满着希望。Our entire lives will be filled with hope. 亨通。And we will prosper. 我们就会成为一个成功的人。We will be successful. 啊，那如果我们呃。逆着这个智慧而行的话， wisdom, 那就会失败， fail, 就会灭亡。我们被毁灭。啊，这就是这年书告诉我们的。而且啊，我们如果看第九章啊， nine, 啊，从第一节到第六节，我们知道啊，生死啊是呃取决于我们是不是。按着智慧而行。So life and death depends on whether we act whether we according to walk according to wisdom. 啊，那他说智慧呢？啊，第十节说智慧呢，他呃，就是要以敬畏神来做开始的。So verse ten, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. 嗯，啊，所以这就是真言书嘛。And so this is what the book of Proverbs、哦、is about. This is what we often say. We are to be wise. We constantly hear this that we ought to be, know how to walk in our lives.、呃、we must be ethical.、嗯、we must have a conscience.、呃、Because whatever we do will be judged by heaven. So the, all these are very Easy to understand principles, just like the mathematical equation where one plus one will give you two. That translation. Well, what about the book of Ecclesiastes? Translation. If we read Ecclesiastes chapter nine, the two, the third chapter, verses two and three. 
All things come alike to all. One event happens to the righteous and the wicked, to the good, the clean, and the unclean, to him who sacrifices and him who does not sacrifice. As in the good, so is the sinner. He who takes an oath as he as he who fears an oath. This is an evil that is done under the sun that one thing happens to all. Truly the hearts of the sons of men are full of evil. Madness is in their hearts while they live and after that they go to the dead. Verse 5. For the living know that they will die but the dead know nothing and they have no more reward for the memory of them is forgotten. How do we summarize what we have read? Except for death 没有一件事是肯定的 There is nothing that is certain 所以呢如果一个老阿伯对那个年轻人讲说 年轻人你还不懂啦 If an elderly man says to the young man Young man you still don't understand 不一定是这样的啦 Things may not turn out this way 你不能够那么样的肯定啦 You cannot ever be so sure 好像是在跟那个 好像是那个 传道书跟真言书在唱反调一样。So uh, Ecclesiastes seem to be singing a different tune uh, compared to the Book of Prophets. 真的你降行你就会亨通，降你真的你降行你就会成为一个成功的人吗？ And if you do this, you will your lives truly prosper. And if you do this, you say you will really be successful. Let's read chapter nine, verse ten. Whatever your hand finds to do, do it with your might, for there is no... Chapter 9, verse 11. I returned and saw under the sun that the race is not to the swift, nor the battle to the strong, nor bread to the wise, nor riches to men of understanding, nor favor to men of skill, but time and chance happen to them all. So this passage also talks about wisdom. 所以呢,不是说你快,你就会跑赢啊,人家 The race is not to the swift 不是说你很有力量,你就能够打胜仗 Nor the battle to the strong 它是取决于什么? What does this mean? 它是取决于什么? What is the determination? So what is the determinant of success? 这个是random嘛,就是看你的命运哦 So success is Random. It depends on one's luck. This seems to be the message of Ecclesiastes. It's like when we toss a dice, you do not know what number will turn out. So just give it a go, see what happens. 所以他谈到说智慧不一定会令你长生。So that's why they said you may not always wisdom. Wisdom may not. You mentioned wisdom, right? No. Something is not to the wise, right? Riches to men of understanding. 嗯，所以呢，所以呢，有时候智慧啊，其实。对我们可能是一种有负面，会产生负面的效果。Sometimes wisdom will give us negative results. 我们看第一第一章的第十八节。Let's turn to Ecclesiastes chapter one. 我们说要寻求智慧嘛，哈。Because we have said that we ought to seek wisdom. 所以有更多智慧是更好吗？So we conclude that more wisdom is better. 十八节怎么说？What does verse eighteen say? For in much wisdom is much grief, and he who increases knowledge increases sorrow. So, in much wisdom is much grief. In much wisdom is much grief. So, the foolish have their own privilege. Hmm. Still, don't know many good things. Ignorance is really not the best. So, ignorance is bliss. Have wisdom, you will know many good things. Ignorance is bliss. Have wisdom, you will know many good things. Ignorance is bliss. Have wisdom, you will know many good things. 更呃有就这会更多愁烦也更多。Because in much wisdom is much grief. 所以要不要去寻求智慧啊 ？So do should we still go forth to seek wisdom? 圣经书说要啊。Proverbs tell us we must. 啊，传道书说没有说不要了，他只是说你要寻求智慧，你就要要多愁烦咯，看你咯。So Ecclesiastes seems to tell us that in much wisdom is much grief. So it's up to you. 嗯，那传道书看起来是非常。暗淡的，非常黑暗的，因为他说呢，没有一件事情是肯定的，除了死。So Ecclesiastes seems to be very pessimistic because it says there is nothing certain except death. 嗯
。那我们也知道 ，We know， 因为死亡是肯定的 ，because 是必然的 ，death is certain。那审判。也是必然的喽。So、that means that judgment is also certain。我们来看第十二章。Let's ch- read chapter twelve。十三、十四。Verse thirteen。Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear God and keep His commandments, for this is man's all. Fourteen or so. Uh, verse fourteen: For God will bring every work into judgment, including every secret thing, whether good or evil. 我们要仔细看这个结论。Read this passage in detail。虽然传道书说，智慧不一定会让你得到好处。Although the book of Ecclesiastes has warned that wisdom does not necessarily confer advantage， 它可能会让你多愁烦。And it may bring you much grief。虽然他说，金钱跟不金钱。的人，他的结局是一样，跟牲畜一样。So although the book of Ecclesiastes says that both godly and ungodly will suffer the same consequence and end as animals， 真言书的这个传道书不是没有给你解答。But Ecclesiastes does not leave you without an answer。因为他说 ，Because it says， 死后有审判。After death there will be judgment。无论你做什么 ，Whatever you do， 神都会。呃，赏罚。So God will bring every word into judgment and reward or punish。所以呢，字里行间是要告诉我们。And so the message here to us is。我们最后还是要当好人。Ultimately, we must still strive to be good、嗯。因为传道书，它是把焦点起先起先放在日光之下。So Ecclesiastes focuses on things below the sun. 看起来智慧没有好处。So although it appears that wisdom is not advantageous. 看起来 ，although it appears 啊，有智慧跟没有智慧啊，都一样的死。That both the wise and unwise will end up the same way. 看起来啊，死亡就是结局。Although it appears that death is the end of everything. 可是最后他告诉我们， but, 死亡不是结局。But very finally, Ecclesiastes concludes that death is not the end of everything. 死后有审判。Because after death there is judgment. 我们再来看约呃约伯记。Let's look at the book of Job. 约伯记问一个问题啦。Job poses this question. 为什么一人要受苦难 ？Why do the righteous suffer? 嗯，我们看第七章。Let's turn to chapter seven. 第二十节。Verse twenty. Have I sinned? What have I done to you, O watcher of men? Why have you set me as your target, so that I am a burden to myself? This is the Lord directly asking God. God directly,、uh, Job directly questions God. Ah,、uh, you, your eyes are always looking at me. What am I doing? A watcher of men. What have I done wrong? What have I done wrong? Why am I suffering all these? Verse ten. 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 That you should seek for my iniquity and search out my sin, although you know that I am not wicked, and there is no one who can deliver from your hand. 神啊，你知道我不是恶的。God, you know that I am not wicked. 嗯，可是呢，如果你真的要要这样子的来查验我的话 ，If you truly want to test me, this way, 就好像在鸡蛋里挑骨头。Uh, okay, and you just want to nitpick. And you, if you're just nitpicking, ah,、uh, you 当然会看到我的不是啊，因为我不像你嘛，你是绝对的。Of course, you will find my inadequacies because I'm not like you. You are absolute. 所以叶伯基是在问这个问题啊。So Job is about this question.、嗯、其实，圣经告诉我们。And the Bible tells us. 一人受苦不是不是一件怪事。It is not a strange thing that the righteous suffer。看彼得前书。Let's turn to First Peter。第四章的第十二节。Chapter four, verse twelve. Beloved, do not think it strange concerning the fiery trial which is to try you, as though some strange thing happened to you. 嗯，所以。旧约圣经所问的问题。The question posed in the Old Testament. 约伯所问的问题。The question posed by Job. 为什么？为什么异人要受苦 ？Why must the righteous suffer? 啊，彼得给我们一些些的解答。Is 
partially answered by Peter. He says, "Do not think it strange. It is not strange at all." Ah, uh, that suffering has any meaning? What are the benefits of suffering? Ah, not benefits, meaning. What is the significance of suffering? Uh, yeah, meaning. We look at Yah. Let's turn to James. Yah, the first chapter, chapter one, the second to the fourth chapter, verses two to five. My brethren, count it all joy when you fall into various trials, knowing that the testing of your faith produces patience. But let patience have its perfect work, that you may be perfect and complete, lacking nothing. Five. If any of you lacks wisdom, let him ask of God, who gives to all liberally and without reproach, and it will be given to him. Let's look at the fifth chapter, verse eleven. Chapter five, verse eleven. Indeed, we count them blessed who endure. You have heard of the perseverance of Job, and seen the end intended by the Lord, that the Lord is very compassionate and merciful. Hmm. So, in a, Yaka, he tells us. James tells us. 神如果让我们受苦 ，If God allows us to suffer， 它不是没有意义的。It is not without meaning。你需要的是智慧， we, 又再回回到智慧了。What we need is wisdom. We have come back to wisdom。虽然在某些情况，你多有智慧会多有愁烦。So in any circumstances， in, in some circumstances， in some circumstances， you have wisdom。嗯，虽然 ，although you have wisdom， 呃,呃，虽然在某一些情况 ，although in some circumstances， 呃，多有智慧是多有重返 ，so wisdom brings much grief， 呃，整体而言 ，but、uh, overall， 我们是需要智慧的 ，we need wisdom， 当我们在受苦难的时候 ，when we suffer， 是当我们不明白为什么的时候 ，when we don't understand why、呃。雅各书说啊，你如果缺乏智慧，你就要向神求智慧。Anyone who lacks wisdom can ask of God。意思就是说，有智慧的人才能够知道怎样去应对我们的苦难。What it means that the wise will know how to handle the sufferings。我我我是没有犯罪的。I've not sinned. 我说遭受的不是我自自自己自取的。I've su- I'm suffering through no fault of mine. 其实我都一直在帮忙别人。I've all along been helping others.、呃、就像约伯所说的。Just as Job. 我看到人家受苦，我没有束手啊、呃、旁观。When I saw someone suffer, I did not stay.、Uh, I did not keep my hands by my side. 不像我的三个朋友所说的，我是犯了什么罪。I'm not in the situation described by my three friends. I have not committed any sin. 他甚至可以。问神说：“我犯了什么罪 ？”And Job can even ask God, "How have I sinned?" 所以我不明白。So I don't understand.、Uh, 雅各书告诉我们。The book of James says, 如果你不明白 ，If you don't understand， 你就是缺乏智慧。You lack wisdom. 你可以问神。You can ask God. 求神。Supplicate God. So, you know, 有智慧的人就能够知道如何应对。So those who have wisdom know how to handle. 啊，这也不是凭空来而而言的。And these are not empty words. 因为呢，有约伯做我们的一个榜样。Because Job is our exemplar. 啊，他就是这样子啊。He went through the same. 有谁所遭受的苦难比约伯还要大呢 ？Who undergoes worse suffering than Job did? 啊，我不是说没有。I'm not saying no one. 我是问说有几个。I said how many. 啊。那约伯呢？呃，他是要告诉我们，神在每一个人的身上有他的美意。God, a、uh, Job wants to tell us that God has His beautiful will in each person's life. 啊、呃，我曾经读过呃这样的一个故事。I've read of this story. 他说有一个人在织布。And there was a person who was weaving. 嗯，然后呢，小孩子从下面看看不懂啊。And there was a child who looked on one side. 妈妈在织布啊。And the mother weaving. The child did not understand. 那么难看。And because the child was looking at one side. 人生就好像小孩子在看，从下面看织布，又难看又看不懂。Who doesn't understand the beauty because he sees only one side. 嗯，呃，可是呢，如果他被呃，抱起来看，从上面来看。But if a child is lifted up to look at the tapestry that the mother is producing， 我们可以求神哈，用圣灵来提升我们的那个视线。我们看到，哎，原来是那么漂亮。And this will be analogous to us asking God to lift us through the Spirit to look at the situation from His perspective。约伯
在地上，他不知道天上的事情。Job was on earth and he couldn't understand the things of heaven. 他不知道神跟魔鬼的对话，撒旦的对话。He did not hear the conversation between God and Satan. 所以神的旨意他不懂。So Job did not understand God's will. 可是最后， But very finally, 如果我们看到看到四十二章， and if we read Job forty two， 从第七到第十二节， verses seven to twelve. 虽然是约伯哈有一点带着责问的口气来问神 ，Although Job was asking God with an interrogative tone， 可是神没有怪他 ，But God did not fault him。神怪谁 ？Who did God blame？ 神怪他的三个朋友。God faulted his three friends。一直在说，呃，约伯的不是 ，Who repeatedly focused on Job's sin？ 可是他们。错误的地方，神看到不是讲耶耶波的不不是而已。So he, God saw the error of Job's friends. 啊，不在于只是在讲耶耶耶波的不是。It was the error was not only in criticizing Job. 当他们在讲耶波的不是的时候 ，But when these three friends were criticizing Job， 他们是为神来做假见证。They were being false witnesses of God. Because he said God is this, God is this, God is this, God is this. Because they claimed that God was doing certain things and being a certain way. You are suffering because God is this, God is this, God is this, God is this. And they claimed that Job was suffering because God was doing certain things. So at the beginning, I said, if we know God, we will know ourselves. So that's why at the beginning, I had already said, if we know God, we will know ourselves. Yeah, poor friends. Job's friends 不认识约伯 ，did not know Job， 就诬告他 ，and accused him。为什么他们不认识约伯 ？Why did they not know him？ 因为他们不认识神。Because his friends did not know God。所以从四十二章第七到第十二节。So from Job forty-two verses seven to twelve。神说：“你对我的见证是不正确的，不像我的仆人。”耶伯他想他讲的才是对的。So God told Job's friends that you have not spoken of me what is right as my servant Job has。就是说，约伯虽然他虽然他不是完全了解神，可是他所讲的是对的。So in other words, although Job did not totally understand God, but what he had said was right。他不完全了解神。He did not have a complete understanding of God。这样子还有希望。And there is still hope for him. He can go further. So he can progress in his understanding. Job's three friends. But what of Job's three friends? They did not understand God at all. So 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 they Offering. 可是你不配自己献给我。But you are not worthy to offer to me by on your own. 那怎么献呢 ？And how are they going to offer sacrifices? 去找约伯，他是我的仆人。You must ask my servant Job. 因为他说，因为我接纳他。Because I accept him. 因为我接纳他，我就不怪罪于对你们一二三。Because I accept him, I will not blame the three of you. 你看约伯是不是很有很有荣耀啊？ So see how glorious Job is. 嗯，他的苦难。He went through suffering. 所换取的是从神而来的荣耀。What he received in exchange from God was glory. 我们来看罗马书。Come, let's look at the book of Romans. 罗马书第八章。Chapter eight. 第二十八到三十。Verses twenty-eight to thirty. And we know that all things work together for good to those who love God. To those who are the called according to His purpose, for whom He foreknew, He also predestined to be conformed to the image of His Son, that He might be the firstborn among many brethren. Thirty. Moreover, whom He predestined, these He also called; whom He called, these He also justified; and whom He justified, these He also glorified. We often use the second chapter of Romans, verse twenty-eight, to say that everything is all working together. We constantly quote chapter eight, verse twenty-eight, where all things work together for good to those who love God. What is the good? We often say that 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 we often say
神要给你双胞胎。Uh, so God is intending to give you twins. 是这样吗 ？Is that the case? 神美好的旨意不一定是你所想象的。So God's good will is not always as we imagine. 这里讲的很清楚，什么是神的旨意 ？This passage tells us clearly what the will of God is. 嗯、uh, ，这里说按照他的旨意。Says according to his purpose. 啊、uh, ，选召你的旨意啊。And his purpose of Choosing us. He chose you not to give you your dreams, but to give you a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a good job. He chose you not to give us just a Just like Lord Jesus, he said, "So he called him, he chose him. He chose him, and he chose him, and he chose him. So whom he called, these he also justified, and whom he justified, these he also glorified." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my disciples." Because he said, "I want you to be my Jesus, he suffered the suffering. Lord Jesus suffered the ultimate suffering. 这样子呢，就让他配得成为我们救恩的元帅。And that made him worthy to be the of the captain of our salvation. 他就带领许多儿子进入荣耀。He has led many sons into glory. 所以保罗说，我还在追求啊。So Paul said he was still striving. 他说，我不是认为我得着了。I do not count myself as having a taste. 可是我要认识耶稣。But I must get to know Jesus. 像他认识我一样。As just as he knows me. 我这样的追求。And such a pursuit. 就是要，呃，来归入他的死，跟他一样。Is for the goal of entering his death to be like him. 那这样子呢，我也跟他一样得到荣耀的复活。And in this way, I shall be glorified with him, and I shall be raised like him. 啊，那那就是。保罗他所认识的，这也是神呢在约伯的身上要显明的真理。And this is the truth that God wanted to demonstrate in Job's life。我们来看约伯，呃，呃，得到智慧的呃旅程。And let's look at the journey to which Job obtained his wisdom。我们看十三章 ，Job thirteen， 第一到三节。Verses one to three. Behold, my eye has seen all this; my ear has heard and understood it. What you know, I also know. I am not inferior to you, but I would speak to the Almighty, and I desire to reason with God. So he was forced into a corner. So when Job was forced into a corner, he told his three friends, "You don't think that what you say is wrong. You see what I saw, I saw. You listened to me, you heard me. You listened to me, you heard me. Say, don't think I don't understand what you know. I also know what you have heard. I've also understood it." What did he mean? You are speaking rubbish. You are speaking rubbish. So I want to open up and ask God. This is why I will speak out and ask God. 他相信他的眼睛。Job trusted in his eyes. 他相信他的耳朵。Job trusted in his ears. 所以他认为他有资格开他的嘴巴来问神。So Job concluded he has a right to open his mouth to question God. 我们应该相信我们的眼睛吗 ？Should we trust our eyes? 我们应该相信我们的耳朵吗 ？Should we trust our ears? 不要说不应该哦。Don't say we should not. 不应该神为什么给我们眼睛跟耳朵 ？Because why else would God give us eyes and ears? 可是我们不可以绝对只相信我们的眼睛。But we cannot absolutely and only depend on our eyes and ears. 我们要靠神，要知道如何用我们眼睛，如何用我们的耳朵。We must rely on God to understand how to use our eyes and our ears. 如果我们只相信我们自己 ，Because if we only trust in ourselves, 啊，我们也是以为说可以跟神辩论。And we think we can debate God. 啊，我们就错了。Then we will have erred. 啊，所以我们看第十五节。Chapter fifteen. No, 十五节。Uh, verse fifteen.、Uh, 
Chapter 13, verse 15. Though he slay me, yet will I trust him. Even so, I will defend my own ways before him. So he says, I trust God, but I still want to defend myself. So in a way, he seems not to know what he's saying. He's in a muddle, some confused state. Verses 18 and 19. See now, I have prepared my case. I know that I shall be vindicated. Who is he who will contend with me? If now I hold my tongue, I perish. So Chop says, if now I hold my tongue, I perish. So he overtrusts his own eyes and ears. So And this is why he must speak out, he said. Let's read Job 42. Verses 5 and 6. I have heard of you by the hearing of the ear, but now my eye sees you. Therefore, I bore myself and repent in dust and ashes. He knows that what he hears is limited. It's better to see with his eye. But previously, although he says he has seen and heard, but he does not truly see. So he says, "I now see God." I now see God. But now he sees, "I finally see God." I now see God. Previously, I used my hearing, and that is insufficient. Although previously, I used my eyes to see. But my eyes have eyes but not seeing. Oh, I have, but I have eyes but did not see. So what was it that he had not seen in the past? What was it that he now finally sees? Why was it that he did not see God previously, but now he says that he's finally seen God? Now let's read chapter 40. Verse 8. Would you indeed annul my judgment? Would you condemn me that you may be justified? So God says you blindly justify yourself. You want to justify yourself and not me. In chapter 1 verse 8, God already knows that Job is an upright man. In 42 verse 7, God has also seen Job's uprightness. And this is why God does not fault Job, but fault his friends of Job. This is something, there's something very paradoxical. Because God sees Job's uprightness, that God sees Job's righteousness, but Job does not see God's righteousness. And this is the source of the problem. Because Job did not understand God sufficiently. But God thoroughly knows Job. My servant is a upright man. And God even challenged Satan. My servant is an upright man. But Job did not respond to God because he did not see God's righteousness. He constantly only focused on his own righteousness. And this is in chapter 32, verse 2. Then the wrath of Elihu, the son of Barakal the Buzite, of the family of Ram, was aroused against Job. His wrath was aroused because he justified himself rather than God. And this is the source of the problem. If Job had seen God's righteousness earlier, just as God had long seen Job's righteousness, everything would have turned out well. And so this is why Job did not see God in the past, but now he sees God. He finally sees the righteousness of God. So Job is also very wise, although God did not explain completely to him. And God had only asked him a few questions. 
他他的眼睛突然间明亮了。Suddenly, Job's eyes were opened. 所以作为总结 ，So as conclusion， 传道书跟约伯记，他没有呃直接的来跟真言的啊、呃、道德真理有抵触。So Ecclesiastes, the books of Ecclesiastes and Job does not directly contradict the moral truth of the book of Proverbs. 传道书呢，它的结论是说，我们人生的全部，人生的一切是要敬畏神。Ecclesiastes concludes that the entirety of human life is to fear God. 要守他的诫命 ，and to keep the commandments of God. 他的意思就是说 ，and Job means to say. 他，那他的意思 ，Ecclesiastes， 呃、uh, ，the the book of Ecclesiastes me， 呃、uh, ，aims to say， 呃，他是说我们在活着的当中 ，that while we live， 我们不一定会看到因果，因果 ，we would not necessarily see the cause leading to the effect we， 不是很明显 ，it is not entirely clear， 可是，在死亡过后 ，but after death。最终的审判还是在于神啊。The final judgment is in the hands of God. 所以不要只看到今世。So do not only focus on the present. 我们要看到时候的审判。We must think of the judgment in the future. 那耶伯呢 ？What about Job? 耶伯的遭遇呢 ？What about Job's experience? 耶伯的遭遇好像跟真言所讲的有直接的抵触。So Job's encounters seem to be like a direct challenge to prophets. 这也是跟因果有关系。Because、this is also related to cause and effect. 因为呃，那个真言书所说的就是因果嘛。Because what Job, a、uh, prophet teaches, is always cause and effect. 可是呢，约伯他自己他做见证。But Job himself testified. 在约伯记二十八章二十八节。And in Job chapter twenty-eight, verse twenty-eight. And to man he said, "Behold, the fear of the Lord that is wisdom, and to to depart from evil is understanding." 他知道，说要敬畏神才是智慧的开端。Job, Job knows that the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. 所以无论如何，我们只要敬畏神。So whatever it is, we must fear God. 我们最终就可以以智慧的眼光看透一切。And finally, we will have the eyes of wisdom to perceive everything. 真言。虽然讲得很直接， so、善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。善有善报，恶有恶报。Better is a little with righteousness than vast revenues without justice. So he didn't say, "Ha, you are a rich man, you will be rich, you will get wealth." Proverbs does not teach that just because you are righteous, you will be very wealthy and you will prosper. He says, "You are a rich man, you will be poor and you will be very poor and you will suffer poverty your whole life." He says, "You are a rich man, you will suffer poverty your whole life." So he didn't say, "Ha." So it's not one plus one producing two. Ah, 敬畏神 That you honor, fear God. 守守住诫命 And you keep the commandments. Ah, 神就会开天窗祝福你 And God will open up the heaven windows of heaven and bless you. 这不是圣经的教训 This is not the Bible teaching. 这个是致富福音的假道 This is the false truth of the prosperity gospel. Not false truth. <laughs> false teaching. False teaching. 假道跟假真理。The false teaching. 没有假真理的啊，所以呢啊，我们现在所学习的。So what we have learned. 无论如何。Regardless. 我们如果有智慧。If we have wisdom. 我们敬畏神。We fear God. 还是值得的啦。It is worthwhile. 啊，那我们再来唱诗。Let's sing a hymn. Four hundred and thirty-seven. 